batteries, which is concerning to say the least. Okay, this fucking game is going to cause me to have a goddamn heart attack. Okay, don't need it right now. It's not incredibly dark here. Okay, so I know what's happening here. I remember this. Like I said, I did play through a good chunk of this on my own, but it's been quite a while. It's been like three years. So, we're gonna go through here and- Little fish! <laughs> Merciful God, you have sent me an apostle. Guard your life, son. You have a calling. United States office warrant for seizure case number whatever that is I'm not reading that out loud in the matter of the seizure of Mount Massive Psychiatric Center Murkoff Psychiatric Sy Systems Mount Massive Wilderness Area Country Road 112 affidavit have having been made before the board of directors by Murkoff Hardline Security who has reason to believe catastrophic security failure in psychiatric center with imminent danger of environment contamination. We are satisfied that the affidavits and testimony establish sufficient evidence to require urgent action on the part of MHS and grounds for the issuance of this warrant. You are hereby required to grant I MHS full access to all facilities and surrender complete authority to its agents. By acceptance of this document, you and any surviving relatives surrender all claims of litigation against the Murkoff Corporation and its subsidiaries, subordinates, for the actions of MHS or the circumstances which required their actions, regardless of responsibility. Well, that's just a waste of paper. finish reading that. Alright, what's over here? A big area. Right. Not sure how this series will be cut. Uh, at this point, we're just hitting around 20 minutes. Uh, it might be that I just edited it like I did... Uh, the beginning episodes of Dead Space 2 and all my older stuff, just cut it when I get the chance to if I'm not in the middle of something, or if I'm not speaking, and keep the episodes around 15 to 20 minutes. Hopefully we can get through this before its sequel releases, and we will play that as soon as it comes out. 
I also have the Whistleblower DLC. I plan on playing that as well, which that I've never actually touched. Okay, so there's nothing in here. Save the batteries. Anything over here? Oop, another document. Let's look into the light and read this one. Alright. Murkoff Psychiatric System Project Wallrider. Uh, patient initial CLW Walker. Consultation dated 2013, May 28th. Initial date of patient consult 11, 2011, January 28th. Age 32, gender male, Dr. Rudolf Wernicke. Wernicke. Is that a German name? Uh, notation by Dr. Walsh. Therapy status, morphogenic engine activity plateaued at roughly 2,000 ppm. Unsafe to progress beyond stage 3 hormone schedule. Diagnostic spirometry, that word again, revealed light to medium bronchial accumulation. MRI scans consistent with patients' reported dreams. Interview notes. Walker was interviewed in restraints following his self-inflicted mutilations. Restraint have had to be altered to accommodate his enormous size. Okay, so that's the, the fucker that just threw us off the balcony then. Walker. Extensive dermal eruptions as consistent with failed morphogenic engine cellular activity. He claims the skin ripped from his forehead allows for a truer way of seeing. Seems to have some boyhood experience with Tara... Ta Tawatara? Tautara? Tautara lizards and their par paridial eyes? I have no fucking clue. I'm probably butchering these documents, and I do apologize, but I'm going to read them. He has expressed anxiety about his flesh, specifically around his lips and nose. Attending orderlies should be advised to watch for further self-mutilation. The mental traumas he sustained while serving in Afghanistan seem to be re retarding progression of the ME process. His predominant fixation, amplified by therapy, is a manic exaggeration of military security protocol. A continuation of both chemical and physical restraints is highly recommended. Anything at all? Batteries? Man can dream, I suppose, but... Why do I need to peek? There's a dude in a wheelchair. Okay. Nope. Alright. This way it is. Can't see. Can't see. Oh, fuck. He's gonna grab me. He's gonna grab me. Up against the wall. I don't like you. Okay. I don't really have it. Oh, I wrote something down. A crowd of broken men watching a dead channel. They look like patients. They survived whatever happened here, but nobody's home. That guy. It's Lord Voldemort. Holy shit. Nothing. It would appear that there is nothing else in this room. Scanning this just to see. down. Turn that back on. Could be batteries in these plants, you never know. Did 
objects are updated in the repairs notebook. Trying to conserve as much battery as possible. I don't know what I need this key card for. this creepy guy again. Up against the wall, up against the wall, up against the wall, up against the wall. Ah! Oh. Get me out! Please! You got me in there! Let it clean your hands! So, so, no one's around. I don't think anybody here would care. I murdered you? <gasps> Jesus. Put my camera back up so I can see again. Fuck that guy. Anything? Close this. I keep slamming doors by accident. I don't think there's anything in here. Think being the keyword. Fuck this. Flies on that corpse, I guess? It's gonna be a very slow game. Did I mention that? You can look behind you by holding. Uh, run it. Wait. Why would I need to know that right now? Can you tell me that, please? Where am I trying to go? I don't know what I'm trying to do. I want to hit triangle. That'll just replace the batteries. It's down here. Not it. Okay. Is it this? <laughs> Did that just happen? Okay. I'm sorry you feel that way. Alright, so the only option we have at this point, from the look of it... Oh, there is a door here. Is this open? Of course not. Why would it be open? That just leads back to where we just came from. So... Looks like we're going that way. And the game told us how to run. I don't like the idea of this. But here goes nothing. Sound scared me. All right, time. I got it.